welcome back to Freedom with Frida in case you're new here. Hi, my name is Frida Nguku and this is the best place for you. So subscribe and join the family. This video didn't have an intro, so I decided to just do an intro. I'm actually headed to work and I know the title is all gift from my man, but it's going to be a very long vlog. So this vlog starts here. Please give the video a thumbs up and let's enjoy the juja, the going to the nails parlor and the gifting. This gift is is special to me because I thought in my thinking I was like how could anyone think of such a gift like how you know when you hear gifts you're thinking cars you're thinking dresses shoes things this gift was so thoughtful so that's why I decided to share what my man gifted me anyway let's get moving and see you in this vlog <laughs> Let's start with, I started my driving classes. I know, yes, I drive, but I don't have a license. And the funny thing, I drive even in Nairobi, CBD. I can drive everywhere, but I don't have a license. So I decided, let me go uh, for this training. Also, because I also want to learn how to drive a manual, just for the sake of it, just just for the sake of it. So this is um, that board. It's called uh, what? A town, whatever board, but anyway, this is what you're taught with how the roads function, the roundabout, all those things. Then, this is what they use most of the tests. Lazimo Kwena he part, so you have to know what way to move. And I have realized in Kenya, the things we do on the road, where hey, hey. like I, I anyway. So, I am taking my driving classes. I hope I get to finish up because learning when you're still working is such a hectic thing. Anyway, this vlog is still moving on and let's get moving. Let's go to Juja. Hi guys, hoping you guys are doing fantastic. I am coming from you with the background of the ladies. <laughs> so, there's this place in Juja where people just come and chill. Like you come with your car, with your booze, with your pombe. Why am I talking like Subaru guys? With your pombe, with your friends, with whatever it is, food, snacks. And then you just sit and feel the breeze of the dam. It's actually a natural dam, like it just set itself up and you just enjoy your evening. So my sister brought me here today and I just wanted to show you guys how the place looks. You remember there was a story that was going round about a lady that um, Gary Literemka, like brrr, all the way to the dam. This is the dam, this is the dam. So let me just take you guys to the other side so you can see. So technically, this is how it's looking. It's around four, so people have not come. So normally, um, there's a dam, and then around the dam, people just come with their cars, and then you pack and chill. You can carry food, you can carry snacks, you can carry pombe, you come with music, come with your friends. Technically, you just want to enjoy that breeze, and you're not at home, and you're not in a club. Like, I don't even know what we human beings are looking for. You see, now we already have some cars here. I'm going to show you how how much of um, going out people really want to experience. So you'll be able to see that later once the place is packed. This is me enjoying the water. By the way, there are guys who are swimming. There are some two boys uh, who want swim with everything else was going on. So if you want to swim, I think you can. I saw guys swimming. Also, there's a cabot if you want to just go through the boat and cross to the other side. As you can see, it's a very big dam. You can cross and go to the other side and go, you know, touch water. Whatever it is that you want to do, you can always do that. It's somewhere in Juja and I'm, I'm shocked by how many people know the place. Like, just how many people know the place. And people park here from around that for all the way to late night. Like, not on a top of Sasita. Like you just want to chill. You don't want to be in a club, but you want to enjoy your company with your friends. You see, people are just people are just in their cars. Like how much are we just running away from the house environment, the work? We just want this kind of environment. See, like that guy is dancing. Let me zoom you guys. I don't want to show people's cars. Um, but it's it's around four, and I hear by the time it gets to six this place is fully packed so the dam is just in front so we, like you park just next to the dam so you can feel that breeze there are some people actually are swimming and then it's going all the way around like the other side you can tell there are people let me zoom you guys it's a very huge huge dam i am zooming you like five times so we are people on that other side there's still more people coming in these chips were not that good let me just say the truth but the sausages mm. 
so yummy so this was the lunch i ordered there and i ate uh my sisters had taken lunch before we went so i came and eat now this is getting dark this is how it's looking when it's getting dark you can see now there are more cars cars sorry he what did i say guys there are like almost 300 cars here like by the time it gets to seven there are almost 300 cars and every kind of music is playing there. Those who are listening to reggae, rumba. You see some even come with to sit and they sit there with your loved one, with your lover. And just, yani ni kamu picnic. Come with your seats in your car, place them there, sit, have snacks and just talk and chill. Then you, you know, take uh, photos and videos of the sunset, enjoy the breeze. You can also even mingle with friends. That's where you could, probably you'd meet your loved one there. When you part of one uku, you never know. Or get your wife here. You never know. Or maybe get a business partner. Whatever it is. It's also a place to. You can network if you're. Especially if you're one person who knows how to. Because I remember at some point. Because uh, we were playing music and the car is off. The battery went down. And we had to ask some of the guys to come and help us jump start. That's how you meet friends. You chat. You help each other. Look at that. How many cars. Nabado there's the other side. Nakuna chini pale. There are so many cars here. So everyone mefungua mlango mnasikiza tu ngoma. Technically that's what people do. But anyway, it's a very good place to chill. Especially on Sundays. Most people come here on Sundays and Saturdays when you're free, when you just want to be in a new kind of environment or when you want to hang out with people and you know when you go to a club, you spend so much money buying a mzinga that could be a thousand bob you buy at 3k or 4k. So why don't you have your own music and just enjoy? And you can dance. You can just put your speaker out there and just party. So get in here. You pay a hundred bob for a car. I apparently before they never used to charge, but now they charge. So you pay a hundred, then you can use the facility up to whatever time that you want. So a hundred bob is for a car. I'm not sure about people who come without a car. I'm not sure whether there are people who come without a car though. I don't know. I don't know. And mostly it's a, it's a park and chill kind of environment. Anyway, uh, finally, I went to pick up my package. This package was sent like a month ago, but this uh, shipping agency had issues on it was free sally. So they, they ship from Dubai. I think they ship from other places, but my package was coming from Dubai. So I went to their office in Isili. That's where they are situated. So I went to pick my package. This is me waiting in their office so they can clear me and I can go out there and pick. Uh, you have to get the receipt, say how much you paid for, you know, shipping. It was, I think, 3500 probably 4000 because now dollars got up. And now, let's get moving. Let's unbox. Hey, good people. I'm back. I am back. It's 10 at night. And um, so I went to Isli. Um, I passed. Before I got to Isli, I found Yvonne. Yvonne is a friend of mine. You know what I'm Biashara? The woman was here to buy something really huge. And I'm so proud of her. I love it when women are winning. So we had a catch up and I was late to go to sleep. But finally I went. So the package is here. This is from Dubai. <laughs> My man sent me this and I do not know what is inside. I guarantee you I have not opened it. Is this the way it was sealed? It's around 4 kgs. I looked at the receipt and I realized 4 kg you pay around 3,500. Oh yeah, I passed by the nails nail parlor guys and i made my nails they were looking really bad uh this video doesn't have an intro so i'm sure the intro you're going to see is an intro of me with these nails anyway so i passed by the nail parlor they did my nails this is the nails uh inspiration i had they do such an amazing job they're based in umoja they have different branches they're called called kit nails they're really really good so i go all the way to umoja because their nails will last me a whole month plus whole month plus and it's just 1500 and if you want some decoration it comes to 1700 but it's worth it so i changed they were just the the inspiration had these two decorated the different colors and then i hope you people can see and then now these others were just plain so i changed i decided they can decorate the two and now i'm i'm regretting i feel like i should have left these two open and then decorate this one and these two but anyway they still look good they look so cute. I can't wait to show my man. He was like, I want to see the nails. I want to see. Anyway, let's do this unboxing. I hope you people are down enough to be able to see what I am doing. I've decided to bring you guys down. You don't have to see me. Let's just have a look at the package. 
<laughs> if it's something that I can show you, I'll show you. It is going to come. But if it's something that is just meant for me, I am sorry. <gasps> I am sorry, but I knew shoes was part of that. I knew that. I knew shoes was part of that. This guy has shoes. God. Hmm. Okay. Oh my god. This looks big though. I hope it fits me. I hope it fits me. It looks so big for me. It says, oh my god, 42. I wear 41. Depending with the fitting. Oh. I complain a lot about my oh my god, this is my man supporting my business. I really wanted to get this this stuff for for my company if you've been watching me you know you know how much i've been asking you guys where i can get these aprons so i guess he was like you know what i'm gonna get you some oh my god and he got me three are many what he got me three god babe Ignore my ashy legs, my ashy feet, guys. I'm from Isili. Isili, you walk. Walk. <laughs> Get your man that supports you. Oh my god, this is gonna look so good on me. And imagine I was about to buy the other day then the material. Three of them. Oh my god, baby. This is so good. This is so good. So I think I am going to wear and show you guys. This is my man just telling me. Remember you had the brush. <laughs> the brush guys. So my man telling me you need to say he had been complaining about that uh apron, the overall. That's why it's so so ugly then. And I kept saying, I'll buy, I'll buy, and I don't know where to get them. I guess he was like, here you go. Here you go. I got you some. Navia to the crazy. I'm sorted. I'm so this looks bigger though. Let me pull this. Then I can come back and show you guys how it's looking. Can you guys see me? Can you guys see me? He got my size. This. This. Oh my god. Thank you baby. Thank you. Get your man that supports your business. He had been complaining about I need an I need an overall. I have three. Three and they fit me so well. And I can't wait to brand Joy Mark all over. Oh my god. It's the same size, so they're all just gonna fit me. He knows my size apart from the shoe. <laughs> he knows my size. He knows my size. I don't know why. Babe, why did you think this shoe is going to fit me? But this is so thoughtful. Okay, there's something else inside here. Wow. <laughs> this is technically my man supporting me. So, normally when I'm... Oh my God, this is so thoughtful. There's some gifts that... You really can never, can never even think about. I never thought you would think of such a thing. So this one is what we call cutters. I guess the Dubai is equal different. Oh, oh my God! I don't know how this operates. So I guess he knew I was not going to figure out how it's been used or how to put the knives. So he actually sent me this tutorial after I shot this and after I received the package. So the tutorial is the one you're seeing on the left. It's just showing me how you operate uh, the cutter. Tar. People who don't support businesses. So it's so timely. It's so timely. So I got three cutters. Oh my God. I have got three aprons. Kesha, I have insulation. I am going to rock this. I am going to rock this. Then the material, you know the aprons, the kind of aprons that I've been able to buy here in Kenya, here in Kenya, <laughs> the material is very heavy, very tough. 
what word is that very tough like ningumu sasa hii iko soft i can put my cutters inside here oh my god tell me i don't look cute tell me i don't look cute guys there's some level of gifting that comes with thinking through like really thinking through that gift he knows i love gifts he knows that but he knows how much my business means to me he knows how much my business means to me and he knows how much i struggle especially because he's not here now i am just doing almost everything by myself oh my god oh my god and some of you actually said um some of the videos that i know a proningine actually on my status someone told me that and i felt i was like i'm going to buy one i'm going to buy one but it's very hard to get this overall that fit you especially as a woman that fit you and give you the allowance and the material is good material to stretch not to be so hard zinakwanga ngumu like the one i had ilikuwa ngumu sana so this one oh my god thank you baby there are gifts that you get and you just feel so connected because someone is thinking about they're not only thinking about you they're thinking about your business they're thinking about the things that make you happy you know like i could get a dress i look good and go but someone thinking through and even getting me cutters oh god baby this this you nailed it you you nailed it <laughs> get your man to support your business get you a woman also that support the things that you do because it means they appreciate what you're doing they see they see what you're struggling with like he saw me struggling with all this and he kept mentioning and i remember a time he told me go through that thing today go get an apron let me know how much it is i'm going to buy come ali buy so this is what is me talk oh and it's so flexible oh my god Wait, but your name is a brand. You people are not ready. Anyway. So, thank you baby. That was so thoughtful. I could never imagine you could send me such a thing. Never imagine ever. Thank you for watching this video to the end. Uh, I'm sure this is the intro you saw. I am taking ugali and skuma mixed with spinach and nyama. I mix them. That's a good thing about living alone. You can mix whatever you want to mix and eat. Then I'm going to catch up on a movie. There's a movie I started watching when I was coming from the salon. In I a lost bullet. So I'm about to finish it up. And then I go to sleep. Thank you so much guys for watching this video. See you guys in my next video. Give it a thumbs up. Thumbs up. All right.